All right, y'all. Um, welcome back to another one. Um, a friend of mine, Lee Nelson, has shown me a really, really cool way for snaring beaver under the ice. I believe it's uh, Riley Hess came up with this method. And um, so anyways, it has really simplified <clears throat> how I snare beaver under the ice and, and whatnot. So um, I'm liking it a lot. That damn light. There we go. Let's go this way. I'm liking it uh, a lot because it's just uh, really so simple and it's so quick. Um, so let's get right into it. And uh, this is nothing new. It's just kind of new to me. So um, I just want to go ahead and share it with you guys. Um, and um, I'm looking at different applications for this kind of uh, snare also, um, as far as maybe some open water beaver trapping too. So it's pretty cool. Check it out. So I keep uh, everything in little Ziploc bags. Um, I got three snares in here and then an extension cable. Um, it just keeps it from getting all messed up. Here's my extension cable. It's got a slip on one end. And then here's the snares. Well, there's two snares in here. It should be three, but there's two. Um, all right, here's another one. Three snares. And so... So that's the setup right there. It's got a, a 16 penny nail attached to it um, with a ferrule loop on the end. Uh, the snare is loaded. Um, it's about as big as my hand right there. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead and get it set up. I'm gonna use this, uh, this two by four here. We're gonna pretend that this is a Aspen stick and uh, we're gonna go ahead and use that um as our for our snare pole um so no i'm not gonna put my snares on a two by four and drop them under the ice this is just for demonstration purposes only all right so let's say we got top of the ice right here all right there's top of the ice and um yeah top of the ice so the ice is about let's say four inches thickish or so all right of course, pen is going to go out. There we go. Four inches thick. So right below the ice is where I want to go ahead and hang my snares. Um, so if this was Aspen or whatever you're using, go ahead and peel, you know, some take some chunks out of it with your axe or whatever. And um, and then we'll go ahead and mount these snares on here. So, so this is why it's so freaking easy, man. I love it absolutely love it all right so this is uh the bottom of the ice right here um mark right there and um i know some of you guys already know about this but man this is all new to me so it's really cool so just gonna go ahead and set these in Don't nail them all the way in. Don't drive them home. You want that beaver to be able to pull it out. So. And then we'll do another one on the back side here. So cool. All right. So now we can go ahead and hang the snares. You got a cable messed up there. A little bit kinked up. I caught a beaver on this was one of the other snares that didn't hold the beaver, but so <clears throat> there we go. Awesome. Okay, so now what we do is we take our extension cable and then we wrap it through these loops here. Just like so. Pretty dang simple. And then um, this end right here, that slip right there. Okay, 
I send that to the top, okay? And that goes above the ice up here. Um, and then I cable that off with my, with my cross piece or whatever. So that secures it. Um, what you can do also like right now is, is go ahead and, um, good little tip is to, let me grab a trap tag. So take your, take your trap tag. Take your trap tag and, and just put it up here, you know, above where, you know, in case game warden comes or something like that, they can go ahead and see who this is. They don't have to pull the whole thing up. So, um, um, so yeah, that's the setup, man. It's super cool, super easy. You see how fast I did that? Um, yeah, I freaking love it, man. Um, I got a spot now that I... Um, I tried to get some beavers out of there, I think back in December. I think I'm going to go back in on it. Um, it was right before wolf season started, and then I ended up just pulling them. But, uh, so yeah, just peel that up right there. And, um, man, it works freaking great. All right. All right I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, if you would, do me a favor, hit hit the subscribe button, hit a like, and, and all that stuff. So just a little little tip out of my shop here. Um, trying to think of some content to put together, but, uh, you guys have a great day.